see if we can uh, get some kills. See, I reckon we can win this fight. If Teo doesn't get fucking got. Oh my god, he's on you. Oh, this is good bait. This is a good bait though. Oh, oh, this is a triple. This is a triple. Better, better. Oh, yeah, flashed it. Got it. Rengar, you nice slows, man. Nice fucking slows. Oh, this is Penta. Oh, yeah, it's Penta kill, guys. Oh, yeah, we're back. Have a Alright, so I got uh, placed in Silver 3 this season. Nice, guys. I did my provisionals. Went kind of alright. I got went 4 and 6, so I won 4, lost 6. And uh, I was gold 2 in the preseason, so it was a bit of a drop, let's just say that. But my MMO was kind of crap, so I was kind of rising and kind of, like, I was kind of climbing, but I kind of wasn't. But this season, we're going to see how we go. I'm going to be posting all my ranked videos from now on. Highlights and all that shit, so you guys can see how I'm climbing and shit. And yeah, let's continue with the video. I'll show you guys some more of my gameplay as I'm playing ranked. Solo queue and dual queue. Oh yeah, this is a split push part. I hope you guys enjoy this. This is just a little bit of split pushing technique you can use. I recommend using it in solo queue anytime you want because it works every time. All right, so what you do, make sure you always have the wall on you as I place it around about here. Yeah, place it here. I can see that, also I can see that Yasuo is going to TP because I know, I just know for a fact that he's got it up. So he goes and TPs as I TP in exactly the same time. I go and I go straight for the inhibs, see if I can get two inhibs off this. Obviously Lee Sin stops the backs, works out perfectly well. Because Annie is Annie's not the problem. Annie's the problem, not Leona. So I keep pushing. I do not stop. If it was Annie, I may have stopped. Definitely actually. So I just keep going for it. Gragas is coming as well. I pop my ulti so I don't die. I don't need to, but I probably could have kept it. But besides the point, I've got three inhibs now, and this game is pretty much over. So yes, I'm, I was playing Ramus' game. Um, let's just say he's a bastard champion. I reckon he's gone. But uh, we ha we ran into a few problems here. Now, Vayne was somehow not dying to my taunt. Or W or shit. And I was like, what the fuck? How is she not dying to that? And at this stage, I had a thorn mount. Hey, uh, what's the fuck is this called? Dead Man's player as well. So I was kind of crying a little bit, and this game was nearly about out of... We nearly lost this, because I got a Baron buff. Um, so we had to find a bit of a way to get back into the game, so at this stage... We've got five players just running around here. We had a pick, obviously I don't know where the rest of the team is, so I can't really say that we should engage here. But we do anyway, if I remember rightly. Well, I just go in. I'm queuing... I don't taunt Alistair. You do not want to taunt an Alistair. That's the dumbest thing you can possibly do. I right, am taunting Lee Sin here, which is a bit weird. But then I run. So even though I fucked up something here, like I went in, 
I saw that Ezreal was getting fucking stomped. So basically what I was trying to do was trying to peel for Nami and Ezreal. Yasuo does the exact same thing. He helps out too. Nami's job is to do that anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But Yasuo does that. Then goes in. Yasuo ends up actually doing well. And which is really weird because look at his score. He didn't know how to auto attack. He was really just very average. But because I peeled and Yasuo peeled too... He ended up getting a quadra kill, and um, it ended up we ended up winning. So it was quite a nice game in the end. But I'm quite awkward. Like I fed a singed. Let's not. Do you wanna have a look at how I fed him? All right. So I was kind of you know trying to fight him, shit like that. And then he ignites me, and I'm like, what the fuck? The singed if ignite, and uh, it kills me somehow. I probably could have queued. I'm really ordinary, but I'm 3 and 6 here, and uh, we get to about 33 minutes. We're damn, we could easily lose this game. We, we actually, like, if you look at our base compared to their base, it's a lot worse off. And they've got the upper hand, as you can clearly tell. Their team fights much, much better. Probably much better, actually. Yeah, it definitely is much better. But it doesn't matter, because at this stage, Lee decides to try and take my red. So I take the red with an E. I, for some reason, Fizz fires his ulti because he thinks I'm going to be chasing Lee for a little bit longer there. So then I keep chasing. This is really turns out really well for me. And I just keep fucking autoing. Now this bit here, my Olaf, fuck, fuck with you. Don't fuck with me, play. And what the fuck, like honestly, Twitch is coming up from the back here. Like, what? What is this positioning? So I don't care. My team doesn't care. They're just fucking them up now. At this stage, like, we have literally nearly, like, off this, we can nearly win the game. But then we, I, I laugh my head off because I see this singed. Look what he's doing to him, to my team. He's doing exactly what I did, Nelly. And he's surviving with Jana just shielding. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? He nearly fucked up our whole team. But it still doesn't matter because my play before was that just honestly sexy that it literally won us the game. Now... We, we do also get a nice MF ulti here, which really does actually probably win us the game. I also, but I mean, my player was still exceptional, wasn't it? Um, but yeah, we are. We just get this really nice MF ulti. Lux just fucking ran on the ultis, but it doesn't matter because at this stage, pull out, pull out the socks and move on this game within a matter of seconds. Now, this, yeah, well, this. These are my last two games, guys. Um, so I was on 50 LP after this game, and then I played another Olaf game, which I fucking lost. Um, but yeah, so I'm on 38 LP now. Um, let's just say I'm pretty fucking happy. If you guys want to see some games where I lose and shit, just uh, tell me in the description because uh, I'll post them. Um, I don't know why I didn't post any cover because there wasn't really anything that exciting on there. I was kind of playing badly in those games that I actually lost. So really, I should technically should have lost them. Maybe.